On Saturday, the UConn women's hockey team took on the University of New Hampshire Wildcats. After a dominating win the night before, the Huskies came into Saturday looking to repeat their performance. In the first period, Connecticut had plenty of opportunities to find the back of the net and put themselves out in front. However, they were unable to put themselves in front, but thankfully, Tia Chan was a wall for the Huskies and was able to keep the game knotted at zero after the first period. I have a lot of confidence in Tia. She's doing great this year. and. Uh... You know, even Meg Warner was eight seconds away from a shutout yesterday. So it was a great defensive game for us. And, um, you know, just really happy that both of them are on our team, Meg and Tia. Khan's offense was putting on a clinic in the second period as they were able to score twice, courtesy of Maya Serdagny and Claire Murdoch. The more impressive stat is that after two periods, they ended with 26 shots on goal, proving their dominance on the offensive end. We were playing real well, um, and uh, the puck just wasn't going in. Their goaltender played great, and I think I just basically the message was keep doing what we're doing. I uh, don't you don't have to change anything. It's just we're going to get chances, and we've got to look to bury them when uh, when they come. So we were fortunate to get two and held on there, um, and uh, we're happy with the weekend sweep. The Huskies' defensive effort was prominent in this one from start to finish as they shut out the Wildcats, taking this one by a score of two to zero. The Huskies will travel to Providence College next Friday to continue their Hockey East schedule. Until then, from Toscano Family Ice Forum, I'm Alec Bean, UCTV Sports.